Hello and welcome to Maths with Jacob. This lesson will focus on Pythagoras' Theorem. On the next two slides I provide the lyrics of a rap song about Pythagoras' Theorem. Enjoy. Okay, let's have a look at the next three verses. And now let's have a look at the lesson. So we have two examples here to demonstrate how we use Pythagoras' theorem. Example 1 says, find the length of the hypotenuse in the following right angle triangle. So it is a right angle because that side is 90 degrees. So this side here and that side there, they are perpendicular to each other. And there's the hypotenuse which is always the longest side. Now Pythagoras' theorem says that the square on the hypotenuse, that is h squared, equals the sum of the squares on the other two sides. So when we write down the actual formula, we have h squared equals 5 squared plus 12 squared. And you can see the square on the hypotenuse equals the sum of the squares on the other two sides. So there's our equation. To simplify that line, we have this line here. Adding those two together gives us h squared equals 169. So h will be the square root of 169 and h is 13 centimetres. So you can see here the units are in centimetres, the same as the original units here. For example two, we're asked to find the length of k, which is also a right angle triangle. Now it doesn't matter which side it can be, because in that example we saw the hypotenuse. Here it's just one of the other two sides, but the formula is the same. The square on the hypotenuse equals the sum of the squares on the other two sides. So k squared, okay, plus 40 squared. Okay, so here we have the sum of the squares on the other two sides, and that equals the square on the hypotenuse. So that gives us that line. Now simplifying each of those, we have that. So if we subtract 1600 from both sides, we get k squared equals that. k squared is 81. k is the square root of 81. So k is 9 centimetres. So we've seen with each of those examples how you can use Pythagoras' theorem to either find the length of the hypotenuse or the length of one of the other sides. So Maths with Jacob has attempted to integrate mathematics, English and music and we've attempted to do that by providing a rap song about Pythagoras' theorem. 